What's the matter, Tara? It's just this guy I'm interested in. He turned me down. He's crazy not to be interested in you. You're beautiful. Thanks, Fenway, but uh, by the way things are going, I think I'll be a virgin forever. Would you two please get back to work? Ah, who gives a shit? Bob, Bob, wait up, man. Hey, man. Got sent home permanently. But Dick ripped up your walking papers. You saw that? Yeah, I was spying on Tara and I saw the whole thing. You sick prick. You know, you need help. Look, if you're going because of what I said about Tara, you shouldn't. I lied. You mean you and her didn't... <laughs> Never. You fucking ass. Bob, I need you here. I didn't want you to quit. You're my ride. And, and this place wouldn't be the same without you. We've worked here for years, man. We've got tons of history. Remember when you lost your virginity in the hockey change rooms? Don't let some front desk chick ruin all that. Ah, uh, Kelly. Right in the middle of her dad's beer league game, too. But I've made up my mind, David. Time to move on to better things. And where are you gonna go now? There's no arena for miles. I don't know, back to school? You already went to school, and you still work at this piece of shit. It'll be different this time. Come on, man, I'm begging you. At, at least for this weekend. Then you can do whatever the fuck you want. I already made an ass of myself in front of Tara. It's over, David. I'm sick of this shit. I want something more. So what? You gonna try and be a writer like you always talked about, eh? I got an idea for a book. The biggest, most selfish prick in the world. Bob's autobiography. David! One condition. I want you to stop spying on Tara. Sure. And I want you to fix the ice. But you fucked it up. See ya. Uh, okay, okay. That's two conditions so far. Anything else? Coffee and sprinkle surprise on you? Done. And I want a hand job. What? Really? But but I don't want to. It's okay. We'll do it in the car. The fuck's wrong? Psych! With you? Holy shit! You're gonna do it too, you queer! What would your dad say right now? I hate you, you know that? <laughs> Let's just go get some coffee, man. Okay, but Dick wants me to stop by the liquor store. It's 10 a.m. I know. We have to go to Quebec. Yeah, how many sprinkle surprise you got left? <laughs> 